Hi guys, welcome to my review of the 2013 BMW 650 Coupe. And today I'm gonna to talk to you guys about whether or not this car is worth the money or not. So, you guys think N63 and you start running the other direction. All right, I get it. It was it was a horror story when the N63 first came out. But after 2013, these cars came powered with this, the engine called the N63 TU or N63 Technical Update. And although some people, they still burned in their head the, the nightmares of the previous engine, all the problems which we we'll see them were fixed with this updated version after the, the terrible launch the previous uh, BMW 6 Series had. So, on top of getting more horsepower from the first iteration of the engine, you get a huge boost in torque and you get some updated features on the interior as well. So, reliability, it's better than most BMWs, uh, somewhat, if you put money into it. People think that a BMW should run no matter what and that's why they say it's unreliable. But if you take care of it, the car like your child, you won't have as many problems as most people would say that you would have. So, this particular car has 445 horsepower compared to the previous 408 horsepower N63 horror story. So, this, this particular car is the M Sport Edition, which has the nice front bumper, the 20 inch wheels, has the M Sport exhaust. You know, it's looking pretty decent for $25,000. I mean, you get more car for your buck. You get 360 cameras, front and rear parking sensors, a heads up display, cool seats. Well, let's take a look on the inside. So, this particular car is finished up in vermilion red with the extended, extended leather package. I mean, you can't really argue. It really fits the silver very well. This particular car has 160,000 kilometers, around uh, 70,000 miles for the American people out there. So, that comes the answer to our question. Is it worth the money or not? Well, if I had to say, yes. If you have money on the side to fix it, if you buy a shitty one. That's why it's really important for it to, for it to have a service history. You don't buy a really shady one with 100,000 miles with no service issue, then go complain on a forum saying, oh guys, BMWs are ass, oh God. I mean, that's that's on you, bro. BMWs is like, a, it's like, it's like your child. If you don't take care of it, he's gonna grow up to be an asshole and cost you a lot of money. Well, this guy's base is the same. If you raise it up real nice, you have a really clean model like this one, You'll be the happiest guy. 445 horsepower, red seats. Look at this, look at this guy, I mean, come on. A flippy uppy backup camera, 25K, it's enough just for that camera. Look at it, it's real nice. If you guys have any requests for another vehicle, you want me to tell you if it's good or not for your buck, let me know in the comment down below. And. Let's take one last look at this beauty. Have a good day, guys.